You're out of your jurisdiction, Jones. <laughs> you can't go into the underworld to save your possible sister. Oh, shoot. Push it in the water. Push I'm, it, push I'm, it, push it, push I've it. I've never pushed a log so hard. <laughs> <laughs> You didn't push that log hard Except enough. for that one time. Push! Push faster! <laughs> ich den Heisen! <laughs> mein Führer, I'm coming! <laughs> like, I really like chase scenes as a general rule, but I don't like it when they're so easy that it's really anticlimactic. <laughs> like oh well, no you're dead no 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 you can't get me i'm hiding yeah, under the wood i know <laughs> hide under the log are there spiders that stab with their limbs i know you do know or no know, i was, like, I was uh, gonna I say i don't know but then i changed it to no, no. there aren't there's that one it's one of those things there's probably something like it and a lot of insects have, like, weird stuff. I know. I think there's some kind of spider that mates by, like, the male <laughs> the rips off one arachnid of Arachnid stabicus limnus. Well, no, like, I know, I think there's something that mates and by ripping off one of its arms and stabbing it into the female. And I think spiders are one of the things that do that. Like, I know there's a kind of octopus that does that. Rips off its own limb? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, it rips it off and then stabs it into the female. And that's courtship. <laughs> I think you're supposed to climb up it, maybe? Oh, jeez. Oh, duck down. Yeah. Right below the thing. As I was. You've defeated the spider. Take that, spider. They should have had, like, a different skill level, level up system. Up. Like, level up your jump to this or that. <laughs> and yeah. I don't know. In MMO MMO limbo. <laughs> if uh it's see if if Rayman five hundred thousand people walking around like this. If Rayman took an approach like this, that would have made that game a lot more fun. Actually Rayman two is is a lot like this in terms of tone. Like it's not this dark, but there's a lot of weird creepy stuff in that one. Uh-huh. Yeah, there's this one place called the Cave of Bad Dreams, which is, like, legitimately unsettling. Oh, oh! It's only got the one leg. I almost kind of feel sorry for it. Well, don't hug it! <laughs> No, Come you have on. to be a monster Come and on. rip its last leg off. Yeah. Oh, that's kind of gross, isn't it? Now, is it still alive at this point? Oh, the little leg twitch. It's like, you don't see any fangs. No, it's pretty much dead. I love you. <laughs> I love you, evil spider. That doesn't look like it would be safe. <laughs> Yeah, get let's pu push the giant evil spider torso. Not no. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you ever did that in Zelda? The like the top down and camera angle thing when you grab walls and he's just like, eh, eh. No, I didn't eh. do that. Okay, that's funny. Cause, oh no, no wait, I have done. Yeah, it. When, now I know what you're talking yeah, about. Yeah, if like when you get Zelda to follow you, if you time it just right, you can like walk it a certain way. So she's like by a wall and you grab the wall yeah. and grab the ball. Man, I really want to play the new one. Yeah. The Link Between Worlds. Mm -hmm. You can, like, make yourself into flat Link and yeah, go on Yeah, I want to play that so bad. It's like, oh, man. I think this is the longest time I have gone without playing a new Zelda game since it came out in, mm -hmm. like, literally since I have started playing Zelda. Wow. Yeah. Let's go grab your crate crates. Okay, writing it down hasn't worked a lot in the past, but... Wait a minute. Uh, I don't remember which way I want to go. I guess this way. Right? Well, I know I get, like, the general <laughs> the general place you want to go to is usually to the right, but... The general direction in which you would like to keep advancing yeah. is right. I just, but, you know, you require, there's a little bit of backtracking every once in a while. But not that much. But why are you... Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> now, that is something that is kind of good that I would give this game credit for, is that the ground is not just a flat, featureless plane. And because it's actually modeled as 3D and... Or not 3D, it's modeled as multi-level and is multi-level. Because it would have been very easy to just make this completely flat. Yeah. With the appearance of being multi-leveled. Well, that's mm. something you would most likely like to avoid. Wow. Nothing like some brain bug platforms. So, grab on the brain head. <laughs> <laughs> okay. We are making our way. I wonder what that was. Some sort of fungus? Brain bug. That looks like a giant brain rock. Slug. That Ooh. looks like a big trap down there. You gotta put something down there. Cause see, right. look, that is so a trip. Yeah, I, well, I see that, but he's not doing anything. So, cause he's not dumb enough to fall in. I'm not gonna be dumber than him. Oh yeah, just grab the body and pull it up. Boop. Come here, buddy. Let me drag your face along the ground. And that's the other cool thing about this game too is that like, um, when you're moving stuff, it has different physics for whether or not you're pulling it or pushing it. Mm -hmm. Like, and actually feels different to do both of those. <laughs> oh man I think I know where the fungus came from now okay I guess because like they're biting at each other that, yeah Yeah. okay I, well, I was going to say go under when they're in, like likely to ignore you but I guess that's not going to happen oh wait he's in the background is he sad or dead I can't tell he's dead okay well dead well, and he sad did. or sad before he died now he's just dead he's dead sad hey <laughs> Look at this. I, I wonder. I like how he looks up. Just yeah. like, hmm. Well, it's a subtle. It's like a hint system, basically. Okay, I totally thought that was a switch. And like, if you stepped on the switch, it would activate the thing. Really? Yeah. Hmm. I'm gonna be honest. I've done this part before uh, on my yeah. on my phone. One of those times I was helping out my beautiful wife. Ooh! Oh, yeah, yeah. Her. Uh, oh. Like that. Uh, Blowguns are one of those weapons, like, it doesn't seem like they could ever be efficient. Uh, Mythbusters, blowguns underwater. It can happen. Okay. Yeah. Like, it's, it seems like a weapon, like... It would be first choice. In most cultures, you could probably make a bow or a crossbow or not a crossbow that's <laughs> way more advanced but like a bow at least you should have the natural resources for it. would a would a blow door dart <laughs> a blow door <laughs> would a um, blow dart be more uh, quiet though than it, than it I get well I don't think substantially and it's one of those things once it hits what you're shooting it doesn't really matter because yeah. they're both well no arrows were you kill people with arrows. I don't really know if you kill a lot of people with blow guns. It doesn't really seem like a <laughs> If there's like a poison. That's like an animal killing weapon, yeah. not really a human killing weapon. 